studying Romeo and Juliet. Here's how you can analyze that for scene one. The scene opens with Paris and Friar Lawrence talking about Paris's upcoming marriage to Juliet. We can see that he's really irritated at how much Juliet seems to be mourning and weeping Tybalt's death. Friar Lawrence realizes that the wedding is going to happen really soon and he speaks directly to us as the audience showing that he's uneasy about marrying Paris and Juliet. Juliet then enters and we can see that whilst Paris is really excited about the upcoming wedding, Juliet doesn't seem very keen. We can see that there's an emotional disconnect between Paris and Juliet. Paris speaks using alliteration as he questions Juliet whether she's come to make a confession to Friar Lawrence. Paris mildly criticizes Juliet for crying so much and we can see here that he's being really patronizing. He speaks using Ironbeck pentameter to show that he's quite impatient with her sadness. Fire Lawrence then uses the confession as an excuse to ask Paris to leave him and Juliet alone. Once Paris leaves, Juliet is desperate and she speaks in this exclamatory sentence telling Fire Lawrence that she doesn't know what she's going to do. Friar Lawrence is really compassionate. He tells Juliet that he knows exactly what she's going through and he feels really sorry for her. Worse still, he knows that Juliet is going to be married on Thursday, so she has no time to even get over her grief from losing Romeo. We can see that Juliet is desperate to come up with a plan. She turns to Friar Lawrence as he's the only person who understands her position and can help her. She repeats the noun knife twice to state that if he can't help her, she's going to kill herself. Friar Lawrence is worried and he speaks using Caesura to tell Juliet not to act so fast he's going to come up with a solution. Juliet is frantic. She speaks using listing to say that rather than marrying Paris, she'd rather do anything else. She'd rather stay with snakes, be among roaring bears or even live in a graveyard than marry him. Friar Lawrence comes up with a plan. He tells Juliet to go home and act as if she's happy to marry Paris. Friar Lawrence then gives Juliet a strong sleeping potion and he tells her that when she gets to bed, she should drink it and that should put her in a deep slumber. He speaks using this metaphor to say that once she's drunk this potion, she's literally going to look as if she is dead. He then speaks in iambic pentameter to say that her family will then think she's dead and they will bury her where all the Capulets are buried. He will then tell Romeo about this plan via letter and Romeo will come from Mantua to rescue Juliet and they will run away back to Mantua. Juliet is really excited about this plot and she speaks using repetition as well as exclamatory sentences to say that she can't wait to get the potion so that she can get this plan underway. Friar Lawrence is really happy to have found a solution and he promises that he's going to give a friar a letter and this friar will be his messenger and he'll send this letter to Romeo in Mantua.